Yeah, can we show the um, photo of Of our Cherry? next guest. Yeah, she's the most followed wo woman, one of the most followed women in Asia. Can we, parang wow, nakaka, nakaka, ano naman, nakaka humble naman, nakaka flatter naman to be in this company. There, look at her. Yeah. I don't know how many, 36 pounds ago and now this is how our rock star is. At first, when I first met her, I was thinking, bakit kaya rock star? Bakit kaya rock star? Tapos, I finally got to attend one of her sessions. And wow, it was amazing. When did you attend? Um, About two years ago. Yeah. And oh. people, Alri, have you heard of Tony Robbins? He, she, of course. Yes, of course, of course right? And he's in several movies doing cameo whenever they need something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she does, uh, she has joined him. And in terms of NLP, what is NLP? Oh, and really? Wow. Uh. Yeah, she's a certified NLP practitioner. Um, she has worldwide certifications, different places from London mm. and from London and from <laughs> Singapore. So uh, you have her whole bio. So can we just do a quick round, round down quick? Kasi ang dami eh, di ba? Napakadaming yeah. bullets. Neto, actually... Yung, kahit yung condensed or shortened version, oh, mahaba pa rin. So, ano ba ang NLP? Ano ba ang kanyang, uh, bakit ba siya most followed? Okay. Well, ang NLP stands for Neuro Linguistic, uh, Neuro Linguist, uh, Linguistics Practice. And um, it's all about mind setting, you know, what you say, you end up believing. And our guest, Sherry, is one of the few certified practitioners here. Um, and this is so important as we head into the uh, uh, modified enhanced community quarantine. Yes, can we have Sherry on? Happy birthday first to Gabby, her daughter, and thank you for you being here. Sorry, I told you naman talagang dahil transform, transformation culture, it took some time. So, Sherry, please, um, please uh, introduce yourself on what are, what, how did it come about yung maging most followed? How to be you ba? <laughs> Una sa lahat, uh, Rachel, uh, good afternoon. It's wonderful to see you here, right? And you're glowing with energy and, uh, you know, positivity. Kanina nakikinig ako sa'yo, the voice was really upbeat, so I can feel it. So it actually, that energy came to my room right now. Thank you so much for expanding this, uh, you know, th this level of sharing and generosity, which our world needs so much now. Okay. Nakaka ma you know guys, talagang she is a life changer. You would see her in her sessions. Um kaya natutuwa ako to hear that from you. Maraming maraming salamat. Okay. So, please tell us about NLP. NLP, I first started, you asked me how I stumbled into this. I first started NLP when I was in Singapore. I lived in Singapore for five years. Uh, and ang ginawa ko, no, I really wanted to be part of something meaningful, a vacation that I will, you know, where I could pass on a legacy to the the name uh, before us. So I thought I want and transformation. So yeah. So NLP uh, in a nutshell is neuro linguistic programming. Neuro is the brain. Programming, yes. Linguistic is the language and programming habits. So if we want to transform, to break through, to change our lives, we need three things. Now we need a powerful mind belief system. We need to be able to say the right words, resourceful words, because whatever it is that you say, it will command your, it will create your things, no? And then pagkatapos niyan, kailangan yung programming natin, yung habits natin must be useful. If our habits are not useful, then uh, we are just actually moving backwards as a nation and as an individual. So yan lang NLP, very, very simple lang. Yeah, and I'm such a strong believer of that. Even if before NLP, I was aware of what NLP is or that there is such a ter term. Because like, for example, ha, happy to serve. In fact, 
it really convinces them that they're happy to serve it. Because on the other aisles of the supermarket that we are talking about, they have their own, um, you know, uh, challenges. But what they are. They, they, parang there's programming, eh. happy to serve, di ba? Parang there is a bell, para sila that um, mm -hmm. the training program, and then biglang nagiging happy sila. Tapos in national bookstore yes. naman. Uh, ang 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 ano ko dyan is uh, our emotions. Uh, if I may, ano, Rachel, uh, Milky, yes. yung our emo our emotions sometimes define our emotions, di ba? Uh, we need to understand our emotions reside in us. We do not live in our emotions. So, yeah. di ba, mas powerful tayo sa emotions natin. Now, uh, if we wanted to control our emotions, we wake up and we don't feel good, we're feeling bad, right. we need to actually move because motion, di ba? Energy in motion is emotion. Uh, we need to yeah. move and, and it will change, you know, something inside us, the chemistry, something inside our bodies will change. And then we will feel that. We will embody that. Ang tawag natin embodiment. So when you say happy to serve, for example, if you're saying that only in words, hindi mo siya ina-embody, then hindi siya strong. Pero pag embody siya, meaning every part of your body feels that happiness and that joy, it will actually express on the outside. People will feel your energy and it will just expand. Yes, I I'm, I'm such a believer. So on a parang on a personal level, for example, parang feeling mo bad hair day. Medyo mm. ay nako, shocks, malilita ko and then mahuhulog tong cellphone ko, nahulog na yung cellphone mo. Nako, naiinis ako. Tapos may mga things just snowball and not yes. and not favorable things happen. And it's all because yun na yung yun na yung inalagaan mo na mindset. So unlike yeah. if you're just happy, you know, then everything, you know, every nothing is perfect, but things will seem like it's just light, and that's the energy you give. And who wants to be talking to someone so grumpy? So, yes. kaya if you, I, I know you were listening in on the conversation with Ponzi Pichi. Maganda kasi, di ba, yung... Uh, gagawin yung transformation that she is spearheading with in collaboration with the police uh, PNP of Quezon City on how to go about it. And I believe in training our mind. Yes. So how does that happen? Like for example, ngayon kasi sabi natin, let's seize the moment. Carpe diem na kailangan uh, we're in for the progress in the barangay level. Paano natin gagawin yan? Kapag nagko-comply lang ang body natin, di ba? Because there's a punishment, short-lived lang yan. Di ba? Pero if you actually enroll the heart and the head, mas mahaba, no? And in fact, it could be a permanent change in us. So I think it's very important that as we try to transform as a nation, no, there must be a message that this crisis is telling us. And one of that yes. is to transform. There's a next level, di ba? Um, right, so right. It's very important na aware tayo na hindi lang, no? We don't just require the body to move. We also nourish our spirit, you know? We nourish our hearts at the same time. So, uh, Tama yung sinabi mo kanina, no? inaalagaan ang mindset. Kasi di ba sa tayo, alagaan natin yung body natin, nag-exercise right. tayo, we're eating the right kind of food. But what do you do every day, you know, that enables you to nourish your mind? And okay. So, paano nga ba manu-nourish yung mind how can we keep convincing ourselves na no i have to keep doing because it's such a hard track eh? like what you did for example it's beyond just weight loss eh? it, it's hard eh? you have to convince yourself not to eat junk i and i mean that mm -hmm. in unhealthy manner not junk junk food only but to eat right so how how are you yes. able to do that every day I, I, uh, one of the principles of NLP and one that I've lived with is that the mind and the body uh, are happening in the same system. Hindi siya hiwalay, hindi siya separated. No, it's always together. And if they are not together, you are internally conflicted. So when we 
uh, when we accept the presupposition that the mind and the body are happening at the same time, meaning, let's say, for example, you wanted to lose weight, kailangan yung mind mo is also telling your body that you need to lose weight. Okay, so, paano kung... Bilis kasi ako kumain. No, bilis ako kumain. Go, go. Mm -hmm. Okay. O, kunyari naman, sa kapitbahayan, let's go to the barangay level. Itong kapitbahay ko, nakakainis. Uh, parang, kasi syempre, Facebook friends kami. You know naman how other people are in Facebook. They feel... Ako, ako I cannot relate, but... I don't know, others Others are just not happy for other people. Ah, siguro, like, for example, there's mixed emotion on what happened to the big media company. Others are saying, kasi yan, yung iba naman, parang you feel for the people that's working there. So, um, how are we supposed to address that kind of mentality? Because I, I feel also that mentality, our attitude, and behavior towards other people is what can bring us together. Mm -hmm. It's very important, no, as we build communities. For example, the transformation that's that we're doing right now, uh, at the very, very core of that, that will not happen. Kung sa grassroots hindi nangyari yan. So we need to make sure, de ba? One body, one system tayo. How do you do that sa barangay level? How do you yes, do that among how? the people? Uh, de ba? It, it's a leadership. Even you know, as you actually. You could come up with the most number of rules, pero kung may pasaway, di ba? Right. No, parang nagkakaroon ng incongruence, di ba? Parang na interrupt yung pattern eh. Ako, I like, my, my favorite term right now is coherent heartbeat. Coherent heart rhythm. In short, pare-pareho ang rhythm ng heart natin. No, it's like we are now standing at the present time. There is a future possibility. No, and if you actually move towards that future possibility, may crack yan eh, in between eh. And there are people who are falling through the cracks who are not actually cooperating. And, and hindi tayo mag-forge, hindi tayo graceful as a culture, di ba? Kasi parang may nakihilang papapa, di ba? Meron, hindi tayo nag forge together. So it's very important that we have coherent heart rhythm, which means we, we, we move forward together. And hence, very, very important ang role ng leadership at the grassroots level, di ba? Na parang we need to talk, we need to be able to share the bad news and still make people you know uh, follow you no parang ang, ang, ang message kasi ng great leadership is you know i i will tell you what to do i don't know what it is there it's also uncertain to me we've never experienced this san tayo hugot ng best practice dito di ba uh, wala yeah. tayong excellence sa pagmomodelan kung hindi man it's just in the recent past so what we need to do is to actually just you know rally behind our leader and and uh that leader must be inspiring enough uh, and, and we all forge forward together and that requires great leadership to enroll no ang tawag ko rock enrollment kailangan may and small may strong emotional buy in diba ni rock and roll tayo ng leader natin na hindi lang body hindi lang pagka hindi mo to ginawa pupunta ka sa preso for example uh, we need to enroll both the mind and the heart those are very important organs. Hello, Ral. Yes, you know, that's so, so you are. that's so aligned to what he does because he's also developing um, KPIs for, is it particularly for LGUs? He's developing Ral? Oh, me? Yes. No, actually, um, I, I've, I was telling Rachel earlier, actually, I've always been really, really interested in NLP. Have you guys talked about what NLP is for the viewers who don't know? Um, yes, we think okay, that's neurolinguistics programming, and she's yeah. the champion of it here. And it's I'm super uh, fascinated by it. Yeah, so um, that's something, kasi nga culture building, that's something yeah. that has to be done from the core um, in training for transformation in each yes. barangay. Mm. So, ano yan? Is that something na kailangan? It's a blended learning. Kunyari, si Ral kasi has the online training. Eh. Diba? That's right. what you are developing, online training, particularly for government yeah. ba? Okay. Uh, well, for, for SMEs for us. SMEs, okay. SMEs ang kanyang more core business. So, yeah. is it blended learning? Kasi before this, sinasabi, ah, yung training hindi pwede sa Pilipinas pag online. <laughs> hindi raw receptive. <laughs> But we have mm. both experience having worked abroad. If you have to, if if that's something, if you have to comply with it, 
You will just yeah. have to. Kahit hindi ka matuto, parang feeling mo. Pero later on, talagang it will just sink in like an earworm in your... Yeah. yeah. So how do you plan to go about that? Yes. Questions in terms of how do you for nawala ako. Okay, na okay, okay, okay. I think I think yeah. you're coming back. Hello. Sorry, there. Milky. I did get the, the, the question. <laughs> okay. Uh, the question is, how do I intend to actually spread NLP? Is that the question, right? Yes, and the, especially yes. to build the culture on the barangay level. Just so one barangay at a time, and then yeah, what, all together. What, yeah, what recommendation or suggestion can you make for them to start um, this transformation, like the best way to do it? it as in all ways, it begins with the individual. Right? Right. Exactly. If you are talking about the barangay, the head of the barangay, the barangay leader, Mm -hmm. must embody this. Kasi pagpasok niya sa meeting, pagpasok niya sa barangay hall, ramdam ng mga tao yung difference, yung change, yung positivity, yung mm -hmm. gen I call it generative. Eh. In short, hindi tayo mag masastuck sa problem. No? We are actually solving right. problems. Right. People can feel that vibration eh? and energy is uh, everything, especially in leadership. Agree. So it starts with the barangay leader and then kailangan ngayon, powerful, inspiring, compelling, influential enough siya para naman ma-inspire niya yung kanyang leadership team. Mm -hmm. So, parang yeah. na-inspire niya that everybody is, you know, is totally enrolled into the vision. Hindi right. lang and what aligned. to do eh. Yeah. And align. Because when your purpose is so strong, the how becomes very easy. Of course, you yes. know, you have resources, everything. Pero pagka hindi mo na what you're doing and you're just complying or following, di ba? Hindi siya, ma may kalaban tayo. It's inertia. It's our body. Di ba? Mm -hmm. Kinakalaban natin niya kasi hirap gumising, hirap pumasok sa opisina. Pero kung right. may joy, di ba? May, may happiness, you're very light, di ba? Uh, Milky, we're saying, kailangan light-hearted tayo. Then, yes. umpisa na yan, pag-move forward. And then, dalhin oh. mo yung energy na yan sa mga constituents mo. Right. No, Tuloy-tuloy mo yan, para mag-momentum. Uh, yeah. Correct. I, and there are many containers to do that. Online training, maybe. Be, or it could be a, a rally, uh, it could be town halls, ba? Pagka, mm -hmm. uh, assembly. So many ways to actually share that. No, may forum tayo, and they are hindi naman siya expensive, de ba? So parang at the end of the day, uh, I realize in my training work, no, that people just need to be told. Kailangan lang may buy in. I may right. not agree with what you're doing as a leader. Uh, mm -hmm. and, and as long as you hear my voice, even though you do not utilize or use my suggestions, I'm okay with that. Right. Diba? So parang it's very important that there is a buy-in. Uh, and, and, and alam mo yon. And, and ang objective nga nito is instead, if you, the, the objective of the leader is instead of making my people comply. It's making them yeah. want to do, that, do it themselves. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because energy is contagious. I think their her um, connection is really getting patchy. Yeah. But I think, you know, really things happen because of something. And, and that is because we have to wrap up in as much as we'd like to. <laughs> That's right. Uh, uh, in as much as we'd like to really discuss it because it is so up our alley and uh -huh. we totally believe that you know transformation from smes to the barangay level we have to keep doing that and we'll definitely mm -hmm. have a continuation but each time yes. we want to um highlight that we always pick up something good from all our conversations today she Kwanzi Pichi is really a champion of transformation. So we'd like to be able to push that forward and, you right. know, the, the training and the content that you're building and the training that Cherry is building for NLP yes. or new linguistics programming, which is so important. Hindi lang tayo aware kasi syempre sa Pinoy, hindi naman tayo maraming, maraming ano, uh, terms. Yeah. Although a lot of people actually already sort of do it, they just don't know that it's called that. Yes, part exactly. Of it, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's exactly what I was telling um, Cherry. That, I really sorry, I missed it. Yeah, <laughs> like a technical yeah, issue. Because <laughs> we are doing this already. Eh. Means may karga ka. Karga mo yung libro mo, yung cell phone mo, yung tubig. Ang daming binabalance. binabalance eh. Iniisip mo na mm -hmm. na 
nako, mag-ano na, ma mahuhulog to, mahuhulog to. Kasi syempre, alam mo na na mahuhulog sa dami, di ba? Oh. So you're just bring it, bringing it to yourself all you're the more. You're attracting it. <laughs> you're attracting it. So with that, we'd like to continue this conversation. Next week is exciting because it's in my yeah. neck of the woods again. It's Makati. And we'll find out what the programs are. Uh, this will also be my neck of the woods, actually. Yes. <laughs> Even, yeah, that is the neck of your woods now. And yeah. it, it has been for me for a long time. And yeah. please join in again. And if you have anything to suggest, please do so because that's how we can all progress together. In yes. fact, why I was just telling, uh, I was reading why Arao says we hang us. Someone PM'd her down. Uh, you know, don't, uh, don't. I, I saw that. I love that. Right. I love that. That you know, you share good practices. Oh. So, on that note, we share good vibes, good practices, and we'd like to close. Thank you very much, everybody who joined us. If you are just joining in, you can still catch us um, on demand on the Facebook Live and yep. YouTube channel of V81 Radio. Yes, thank and you for joining us, everyone. Thank you.